Hey everyone, welcome to APG. Hello. Wait, I got a nunchuck, you idiots. Okay, so we've already run into a problem. There we go. So Chili has no experience with Metroid outside of Smash Bros. As is the case with a lot of games. Typically her experience is Smash Bros, yes. Or I see things online and like, I know what that is. Right. Like this. Let me tell you what I know of Metroid. Please do. And then you can tell me if I'm wrong. So, this is a game with Samus. She's the one in a suit. People did not know she was a she? About right so far. She wears running heels, as one does. Uh, not at this point. Oh. The heels are a new addition. She gets running heels at some point. Yes. Does she wear just regular shoes in this game? Uh, this game, I think she, her zero suit doesn't even make an appearance. Ah. At this point, she is purely in her armor. Okay. And also, aren't there aliens? Yes, that's typically what she kills. That is what I know. Okay. Um, now, I'm not much more averse than her on this one, actually. An identified uh, distress beacon. She is a bounty hunter who fights a lot of space pirates. Uh, Metroids are little brain-sucking parasites that she typically has an issue with. Mm. Except for the cute one at the end of Super Metroid, which she keeps as a pet? No, that's not true. Uh, <laughs> she brought it in, and it saves her life. And that leads into the events of Metroid Fusion. How many of these games are there? Yes. That's not an answer. Felt like an answer. <laughs> um, okay, let me think here. There's the original Metroid. Okay. There's Metroid 2. 2. There's Super Metroid, which is the third one. That's 3. Okay. There is... What are uh, those yellow lines? I think those are just energy matrices. There's Metroid Prime 1, 2, and 3, which so is what we're playing. That's like 6. Uh, Metroid Prime Hunters. Are things flying on the ends of the yellow lines? No, it doesn't No, look because like the it. asteroids don't get yellow lines. No. A little space debris. I think the lines are what are keeping it from flying. Is it like an energy I think so, chain yeah. Net? I think so. Like it's holding it together. Okay. Um, let's see here. What else do we know? What other games are there? There's Metroid Fusion. Is we're that, at eight. Are we at number... Wait, I thought we were at seven. What's... Uh, seven was Hunters. Okay. Um, and then there's Other M, which nobody liked. Okay. You know what? I can see how people would not know that Samus was a she. Right. That is not a very feminine battle suit. It is not. That it looks... looks like a very anime-esque Master Chief. You're not wrong. Now, the original game, she looked even more masculine. Uh-huh. This is when they added a bit of a feminine charm to her armor, but even then it's very subtle. You know what that reminds me of? What? Garrus? Uh, yes, that's exactly what I was about to say. The way the hips and the legs are. What are you shooting at? Those things. Oh. Because that's how gates work in this game, typically. Whoop. No. Whoa. Uh, scan the central pillar to is so. scan... That's too much is going on. Move the cursor to the top. Okay, cool. Oh. I. It said it was supposed to be orange if you could scan it. That's not orange. There oh. it goes. Yeah, the scanning was added for Japanese audiences. Really. Yeah, that's my understanding of it. That's curious. Because uh, scanning is more of a big deal there. I wonder why. Uh, I don't know. Do we know any Japanese people? Not per personally. I, I know a bunch of people who really wish they were Japanese people. We both know a bunch of people that really wish they were Japanese people. I, I think in middle school we were those people. Yes. And then... Well, let's put it this way. I can't be proud that I'm white for reasons. <laughs> because of reasons. Uh, it's not letting you fall off. That's pretty nice. Wee! I'm a ball. I'm a ball. That cannot be comfortable for Samus. It can't be. But it makes sense as to why she's all weird and round. Damn it. I'm never going to... I'm going to keep you pressing the wrong button for that. Okay. 
ball. Now, this is the morph ball. And the morph ball gave them the worst problems in this game. Really? Trying to get it to work. Well. Uh. Oh, there's a scanny thing. Why are. Ooh, what the hell is that? It's a space shrimp! Space shrimp, nothing but space shrimp. We're gonna get sued by Disney because I just sang something to the Star Wars theme. Don't do that. And you know, Star Wars just came out. I know. You know what I did today? What did you do today? My phone was all Christmassy because Christmas. Like, um, the. A couple weeks ago. The background was a Christmas tree with ornaments and shit. Right. So I actually took the Christmas tree off today. And now, what I have is space! I like space. It's stars, it's beautiful. <gasps> Whoa, that's another. That is a giant space shrimp. That looks like Kraid. Like what? Kraid. You keep saying that like I know what it is. Uh, he was a boss from Super Metroid. Ah! Huh. Space pirate, dead. That's not Kraid. That's a thing that looks like him. There was another scanny place over there behind the shrimp. Escape from. Oh! Uh, new creatures then download to my logbook. Okay. Is that what? I just killed the space pirate. It looked already dead. It was nearly dead. But nearly oh. dead is partially alive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I mean. Charge and. Pew! Uh, but yeah, like, when, when the original Metroid came out, nobody knew Samus was a girl. It freaked him out. Um, it did, really? Yeah. Oh, that's a space shrimp. Because, like, you only learned that she was a girl if uh, you beat the game fast enough. Fast enough? Yeah, and if you did it even faster, she was in a bikini. Really? Yeah, so it's like, yay, sexism's dead. Oh no, it's only dead if I'm mediocre. <laughs> Yep. Maybe you have to actually, like, be a person. What do you mean? Well, because you were you were on the hologram thing to get the map, and it wasn't letting you because you were a ball. Oh, I just wanted to try to blow it up. Hmm. That's how I am. Talon 5, ground zero. Ground zero for what? Space trip? Maybe. There we go. <sighs> a new research entry has been recorded into the logbook. What is the logbook? Menu? I'm trying. Where is the menu? There is the menu. Oh, that's a cool thing. Wait, wait, wait. Did that say Viagra suit? What? Go back. Very Vari suit. Yeah. Okay, my bad. I apologize. I misread. Not, not the Viagra suit. <laughs> what is the Varia suit? I think that's the suit we're in. It has some cool shit to it. Okay. I like it. What is my grapple beam? Ooh. Okay, nice. It's not what I wanted. Uh, where is the thing? You are there. No idea what I'm doing. No idea. And yet, there we go. I wonder what happened to the space shrimp. You know, if the space shrimp are from a planet, they can't really be space shrimp. They're planet shrimp. Which sounds like a really good red lobster tie-in. That actually sounds delicious. I haven't had shrimp in forever. Planet shrimp! Platform active. And you can get, like, a galaxy platter. Yes. That's perfect. That's it. We need to open up a shrimp place. In ga uh, planet shrimp. Yes. What's that little almost hand in the corner? This little hand? The one the one down on your visor. Or You're in little... your like in your in your in your This one? No, other way up oh, that one. Yeah, no you were idea. Oh. Roll. See here, energy conducting has been damaged. Use caution. Well, duh. 
Specimen containment breach. That doesn't sound ominous at all. <laughs> Owie. What was that green thing? Oh, I'm going back for it. Well, come here, you. Come here. You guess there was nothing that you couldn't get. No, just, just a thing to look at. Its entire purpose was to look pretty. Hmm. Oh, space pirates. Oh, to strafe. And what is that purple thing? I believe that's energy. For our energy can? Yeah, well, no. See the energy? That's our health. Oh, I see. That's good. Do you see that little hand I'm talking about, though? I think I just activated it. I am still confused, but whatever. I don't know what that's for. I have a feeling we're going to get, like, angry comments. No, I have a feeling we're not going to get angry comments, because that requires us to have fans. That is sad. I'm sure someone out there loves us. We have subscribers. We have ten subscribers, and two of them are you. Don't hate me because I forgot my passwords, okay? And one of them's me. So, okay. So there are seven people in the world who are not us. Okay, true. Come here. Come here. I want it. Damn it. There's a scanny thing. Scanny thing. What do you, can you tell me, scanny thing? Elevator operational, please step on a hologram. Ooh. Oh, hold up. Lots of scanny things. Plasmite. Oh, that thing's going to open. You better get out of there. That's terrifying. Xenotropic life form. No, fuck scanning the rest of them. I'm going downstairs. Or upstairs? I'm going upstairs. It's like a giant space leech. Do they only get up when you start shooting at them? Well, no. Some of them are up already. Well, okay, there's, there's, I've seen two that have been standing up. There's three. I'm very bad at shooters, if you haven't noticed. I am too, which is why I like swords. Yeah, to be fair, before we started this, I was at, she said she wanted to kill things. I went, are you feeling more shooty or stabby? And she went stabby, and we went with shooty. And here we are. Yeah. Because I disregard her as a human being. That's rude. It's like your mom. She is not going to be happy. Yeah, she's not a person either. Um, <laughs> that's not true. I love my mom. That's me. <laughs> Scanny. Uh, okay. Do, 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 do. Please step into the hologram. So I love these holograms to step into, and I'm not 100% sir on them. Oh, like, what if we're creepy. just. Oh, I don't like that at all. It sounds like evil space shrimp are coming. Space, space pirate. pirate. <laughs> it only has minimal injuries. Let's fix that, kids. You know, my general... Um, what is it called? Strategy. Uh-huh. Ooh, that sounds like my Wii is overheating. Is that what that is? I think that's my Wii. Oh, no. Please insert metallic sphere. Where do we get the metallic sphere? I think I become a metallic sphere, if you remember. <gasps> You're right. <laughs> Bloop. Bloop. Electrocuting metallic sphere. What? <laughs> you are dead. Thank you for playing. My general... Uh, Bloop strategy for these types of games, though, is, um, just kind of run and run at the thing and shoot it. If I do that enough, I will hit it. <laughs> you see, that's not working for me right now. There we go. Oh, charge beam can draw in power-ups. Ooh. 
I think that's already dead. There was another scanny point in here. Scanny thing. Come on, where? Oh. Right there. No, no, that'd be too easy. Or stuff, or whatever. Insert metallic sphere. <sighs> Fine. You're not going out the same way you came in, are you? I don't think so. Because I'm going to laugh. Okay, no. No laughter here. Oh. 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 Now, in this game, I believe, maybe it's the next one, Jennifer Hale does the voice for Samus. Really? In the Prime series. Uh, so, you're going to hear Shepard. That's awesome. You're going to hear a lot of Shepard. <gasps> it escaped! There it is! Oh, that's like a space roach. They no longer... Maybe a space leech? Space graboid? Mm, I don't know what that is. Ooh, good thing you moved. Now you have to get over to the opening. Oh! Parasite Queen! I will be queen one day. <laughs> Scan your enemy to find its weak spot. Oh, fine. Uh, Parasite Queen, genetically have been here. In the mouth. Okay, so... Aim for the head, zombie rolls. Zombie rolls. Apparently. Oh, it fell into the reactor. I mean, if you're gonna keep your Parasite Queen somewhere... Die? Good, it dead. Yay! Is this the game? Is that it? Uh oh. Oh! Uh, all Metro games at some point will involve evacuating immediately. Really? Yep. Typically in about seven minutes. Okay. Right, scan. Scan, my friend! <laughs> There you are. Defense turret. Oh shit. Did they not get the warning about escaping immediately? Or are they just not? I don't know. I think they were uh, trying to get out like I am now. Whoa, 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 fucker, 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 whoa. fucker. This one's going to be a long one, guys. Sorry about that. I we do not have the time to figure out how to pause the game again while trying to escape to escape here. Escape. No good at escape. Oh, shit. Oh, that's disgusting. Little space shrimp. That's rats. terrifying. Space shrimp, no! No, space shrimp, no! No, por qué? Oh my god, so speaking of Porqué... Yes. You remember Nick? Mm, yes. Okay. So, as you may or may not have known, his uh, dad and uh, another per person who was in his life for a while both worked on the original Fallout. I didn't know that. Um, yeah, well, I mentioned this to kind of name drop a little... Oh shit, how do I get out? Okay. That way. Um, yesterday, because I found out that my girlfriend, uh, Michaela, mm -hmm. her stepsister, is a pretty big Fallout fan. Partially, okay. She's a new Fallout fan, but I don't think being a new fan necessarily keeps you from being a fan. I'm a new fan of a lot of things, guys. Be nice. Right. So, um, she's a new fan, and I mentioned that Nick's dad and uh, other people that were part of my childhood... 
right, mm-hmm. uh, were involved in making the original Fallout, which is part of the reason I feel bad that I suck so bad at Fallout games. <laughs> because it's like, I, it's for me, it's not just a matter of like, oh, these games are fun. It's I know someone that Nick's worked dad on. would be ashamed of me right now That's for how badly funny. I am fucking up at work. Oh my god! Terror! Yes, yes, that is. Oh, you... I hate... What are you doing? Trying to get out. Do we go that way? We have to. Terror! Oh my gosh. Um, So it's like, how badly would Nick's dad be mad at me right now for sucking at Fallout, right? Uh Uh-huh. Well, this turned into me having to convince Michaela's stepsister that eating... My friend Nick's dad is a bad idea. Oh. Because I guess there's a cannibalism joke in the original uh, Fallout that I missed. And she was referencing that, but it's like, I didn't know that? Because I suck at Fallout 1. (laughs) So I thought she was just, like, legitimately wanting to eat the guy. And it's like, no, don't don't eat Nick's dad. That was the nice man who would make us s'mores. Whoa. What's going on? I suck at life. I suck at life. How do I get out of here if I suck at life? Oh, hello. Boxes. No boxes over there. That's the way I came in. Are you sure? Sure looks like it. Oh, to grapple. To grapple. Where is the Z icon? Oh, there. It's not Z. You have to use Z. That makes more sense. We get it. We got it. So I get from not reading uh, tutorials there. So you you thought you said Michaela's cousin? Her stepsister. You thought Michaela's sister was trying to eat? No, I thought she was just being weird. Ah. Because that's the level of weird she is. Ah. Uh, she's the. Uh, ah. Yeah. Mm. Okay. I made some hand motions that explained which one she was to to Chili. I'm not doing those hand motions on camera. It's recording a game. <laughs> No, our suit got powered down, and now we're skinny again. No. You know what I noticed when when um they did that that focus on our visor. Uh huh. She had very 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 arched and feminine eyebrows. So I guess yes. that that would be one way you could that's, tell. That's that's the giveaway. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that and the fact that when she talks, she sounds like Jennifer Hale. Brows on point. <laughs> I'm obsessed with eyebrows, guys. I she love is. mine. Oh shit! How do I get out of here? Okay. That way. Like, eyebrows are important. They're... They are how you can tell Samus is a pearl. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm stressed out. I'm stressed out. My neck itches. Turn around. Turn around. There you go. Room is depressurizing. Oh, my God. Turn around. There was a skinny thing. You don't. I think there was a skinny thing. Is there a skinny thing? Turn around. Airlock repressurization successful. What does that even mean? Means I can get through the next room. It was an unnecessary wait period. Mm. Really? What are these? Okay, we're out. We are in space! Uh, no, it is snowed Oh, that's a space dragon. Uh, that is Ridley. A space dragon. Named for Ridley Scott, whose work highly influenced Super Metroid. Ridley Scott. Ender's, Ender's name? No, you're thinking of Orson Scott Card. Ah. Ridley Scott is alien. I don't think I've seen that. Really? Mm-hmm. Not um, the new one. Not the old ones. Yeah. I know Sigourney Weaver's in it, right? Yeah. Uh, the first two are great. The third one doesn't exist. Okay. <laughs> That's the best way to put it. Like, it, I'm not going to try to defend it like I tried to defend Star Wars Episode One and Two to you. Uh-huh. I'm also not going to get into that right now, but... Alien is great. Aliens is great. Alien Resurrection sucks ass. Okay. We'll talk about that more next time. Goodbye. After this 25 minute.